What really happened when Starship Flight 6 plunged into the ocean? After a controlled descent, Booster 13 exploded, sparking questions about SpaceX's mission progress. Elon Musk revealed shocking details about what went wrong and the implications for future flights. With billions invested and reusability at stake, this event could redefine space exploration. 1. The unpredictable water landing Starship Flight 6 surprised many when its booster, B-13, performed a controlled descent into the Gulf of Mexico. Unlike previous tests, where SpaceX aimed for a Mechazilla arm catch, this mission took a different path. The booster was deliberately guided to the water, showcasing SpaceX's focus on testing new scenarios for reusability. Onlookers were initially impressed by the precision of the water landing. Booster 13 descended gracefully, firing its engines in a controlled manner and vertically touching down in the water. However, what seemed like a successful experiment took a dramatic turn moments later. An explosion rocked the booster, leaving behind floating debris and a cloud of speculation. Why did the explosion happen? Initial theories pointed to structural damage caused by the water impact. Landing on water, even at controlled speeds, subjects the structure to immense forces. Musk later suggested the impact may have compromised the fuel tank, leading to a rupture and the subsequent explosion. The deliberate nature of the landing has led many to believe this was a planned test. SpaceX likely sought to understand how its booster would behave in water scenarios. This knowledge is critical as SpaceX explores emergency procedures and backup options for future flights. However, the explosion also highlighted the challenges SpaceX faces in achieving full reusability. Each failure not only provides data, but also raises questions about whether these ambitious goals are achievable within the current timeline. With billions invested and public attention focused on each test, the pressure to deliver results is immense. Despite the setback, the controlled descent demonstrated SpaceX's ability to guide boosters precisely, even in unpredictable scenarios. This capability will be crucial as SpaceX moves closer to operational missions. The lessons learned from Booster 13's water landing will undoubtedly inform future designs and strategies, ensuring that SpaceX continues to push the boundaries of what's possible in space exploration. 2. The Dramatic Fate of Ship 31 while Booster 13's explosion captured headlines, Ship 31's journey was equally eventful. After separating from its booster, Ship 31 executed its mission successfully before landing in the Indian Ocean. The descent marked another step forward for SpaceX, showcasing improvements in stability and control. The mission didn't end with a smooth landing. Shortly after touching down, Ship 31 experienced a catastrophic failure. Musk later revealed that the ship's fairing was destroyed, likely due to the immense forces involved in the water impact. This failure underscores the difficulties of testing spacecraft in extreme environments. Initial observations suggested that parts of Ship 31 remained intact after the explosion. Images showed sections of the ship floating briefly before submerging. While this provided hope for recovery efforts, the ship's location in the Indian Ocean posed significant logistical challenges. Unlike Booster 13, which landed relatively close to SpaceX's facilities, retrieving Ship 31 would require extensive planning and resources. The destruction of Ship 31's fairing raises questions about its structural resilience. While SpaceX has made significant advancements in Starship's design, the repeated failures highlight areas that need further refinement. The fairing's collapse suggests that additional work is needed to ensure durability during water landings. Despite these setbacks, Ship 31's mission provided valuable data. Each test reveals critical weaknesses and offers opportunities for improvement. SpaceX's iterative approach to development, learning through failure, is a cornerstone of its success. However, with each failure, the stakes grow higher. The lessons learned from this mission will be instrumental in shaping the future of Starship, ensuring that SpaceX continues to innovate and improve. Three. Explosions as learning opportunities. The explosions of Booster 13 and Ship 31 may appear as setbacks, but for SpaceX, they are opportunities to learn and improve. Elon Musk has long championed the idea that failure is a critical part of innovation. 
Each failure provides data that can be used to refine designs, improve processes, and push the boundaries of what's possible. In the case of Booster 13, the controlled nature of its descent suggests that SpaceX anticipated some level of failure. By guiding the booster to the water, SpaceX created a scenario to test its durability and landing systems under extreme conditions. The explosion, while dramatic, provided valuable insights into the booster's structural limits and failure points. Ship 31's failure similarly offered lessons. The destruction of its fairing highlighted weaknesses in its design, particularly when exposed to the immense forces of a water landing. These insights will inform future iterations, ensuring that each new version of Starship is more robust and reliable. However, these failures are not without consequences. Each explosion raises questions about SpaceX's ability to meet its ambitious goals. The financial implications of these failures are also significant. Recovering and analyzing the wreckage is costly, and delays caused by setbacks can strain resources. With billions invested in Starship and high expectations from stakeholders, the pressure to succeed is immense. Despite these challenges, Musk remains committed to his vision. He has repeatedly stated that setbacks are a natural part of progress. For SpaceX, each failure is a stepping stone toward achieving full reusability. The lessons learned from Flight 6 will undoubtedly shape the future of Starship, ensuring that SpaceX continues to lead the charge in space exploration. Fourth, recovery efforts and challenges. Recovering the remnants of Booster 13 and Ship 31 presents a unique set of challenges. Saltwater exposure accelerates corrosion, making it essential to retrieve components quickly. SpaceX has deployed recovery vessels to salvage what remains of Booster 13, focusing on its engine systems, which Musk believes could offer valuable insights. Ship 31's recovery is even more complicated. Its landing in the remote Indian Ocean places it far from SpaceX's primary facilities, complicating logistics. Additionally, its structural integrity remains uncertain, increasing the difficulty of retrieval. Despite these challenges, Musk remains optimistic about the potential to salvage key components. The logistical hurdles of recovery highlight the complexities of testing advanced technology in extreme environments. Salvaging components allows SpaceX to analyze failures and refine its designs. However, each failed recovery attempt raises questions about the feasibility of achieving full reusability. With each mission, the stakes grow higher and the margin for error becomes smaller. Despite these difficulties, SpaceX's commitment to learning through failure remains unwavering. The company's ability to recover and analyze components from Flight 6 will play a crucial role in shaping the future of Starship. 5. The Path Forward for SpaceX Despite the dramatic events of Flight 6, SpaceX remains focused on its ambitious goals. Preparations for the next test flights are already underway, with Booster 14 and Ship 33 undergoing final checks. These new iterations aim to build on the lessons learned from Flight 6, incorporating design improvements and enhanced systems. One of SpaceX's primary goals is to perfect the Mechazilla arm catch system. This innovative approach aims to eliminate the need for water landings, drastically reducing costs and improving reusability. However, achieving this capability requires overcoming significant technical hurdles. Each failure brings SpaceX closer to its goal, but it also highlights the immense challenges ahead. The pressure to succeed is amplified by the growing expectations from stakeholders. With NASA contracts and private investors relying on SpaceX's success, the company must deliver results. Any delays or failures could impact its reputation and financial stability. However, Musk's vision extends beyond short-term goals. For SpaceX, each test flight is a step toward making space travel more accessible and sustainable. The data collected from Flight 6 will inform future missions, ensuring that Starship continues to evolve and improve. As SpaceX moves forward, the lessons learned from Flight 6 will play a crucial role in shaping its strategies and priorities. While the road to reusability is challenging, SpaceX's determination to innovate and adapt ensures that progress will continue. The journey to revolutionize space travel is far from over, but with each step, 
SpaceX brings humanity closer to a future among the stars. Starship Flight 6 proved both the potential and the risks of innovation. Can SpaceX recover and turn these lessons into success? Share your thoughts in the comments below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more insights into space exploration.